Hi everyone, this is Paula from Thrifty Paula. Welcome back to another uh, haul. I've got a Dollar Tree haul and I have some items from um, Target, mainly from the, well, I want to say the dollar spot, but they range from a dollar up to five dollars, I think, what I got. Um, the dollar store has some uh, repeat items. I think think there may be a couple of items that I hadn't seen before the Dollar Tree. Um, so, and the Dollar Tree has some food items. Um, the items from Target are uh, Easter items or um, some things that I hadn't seen before uh, um, that I'm going to try and see how they, how they um, work. So, Target is not a place that I go often, but when I do go, I usually find um, something. So, it was a pretty good day at Target. Um, so, if you are new, welcome, and thank you for watching, and see if you are like, going to like what you see. And you, if you are a repeat uh viewer and one that comes back all the time and a subscriber. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I really appreciate it. Um, if you're new and you do like what you see, please hit the, um, notification bell to let you know when I, uh, upload again and please hit the subscriber button. Um, glad to have you. I really, really appreciate it. So, um, again, there's nothing going to be in any order. Um, I don't have anything organized. We're just going to uh, pick up the bags and go. So let's just get started. I'll tell you the price of the items. Uh, again, my Dollar Tree goes from $1.25 up to $5 items. And I heard, um, I don't know if I heard it on TikTok or where, they were saying that Dollar Tree was going to be changing their prices again, having, um, more um, items that cost even more than five dollars so I don't know how true that is but I guess we'll wait and see what happens so we'll start since this is the first thing in the bag a repeat item that I always try to get uh, I'm really glad when I find the extra large these are puppy pads uh, in extra large and there's four to a pack um, sometimes they are extra large with three to a pack. So this was a four to a pack and I haven't seen the extra large ones there in a while. They usually just have the smaller ones. So I got several of these. A food item is this lemon flavored shortbread cookie, 4.6 ounces. I got two of these. This is a really good at coffee, but they're really good with hot tea. And I like to have this in the evening. Um, um, hot tea and a couple of these cookies. They're really good. So I got two two boxes of those And just candy item I got one pack of these little nerd. These are little nerd gummy clusters. I got one pack of these And then for Easter I saw the star uh, starburst jelly beans so I got one pack of these. These are all dollar twenty-five, and this is uh, a fourteen-ounce bag of the Starburst jelly beans. And what did I see? I saw they had French's mustard, so I just got one of these. Um, it's eight ounces, dollar twenty-five. So that's all in this bag. I did find a new item. This is by Aroma Therapy Signature. It is a lemon scented um, body lotion. It's 5.1 fluid ounces. I only got one of them. I think I smelled it while it was in there. I can't remember. I think I did. Smells good. Of course, it's just the cream, white cream. Um, let's see how it feels on. If I can get the top back on it. 
Okay. Hmm. Of course, it smells lemony. That looks on your hand. Doesn't feel watery. You know, some lotions feel watery. Doesn't feel that way. Um, and it's not sticky. You know, it doesn't have a strong smell because once you put it on, you don't smell it. So, okay, we'll see. We'll see how this works. But this is a new one. Well, I, I, th I thought it was new because I hadn't seen it before. So, only at one. This is the uh, Balanced Pet Hair and Lint Guard. It's, uh, let me see, 30 sheets, fresh scent, and this is for the dryer. So I got, first time I've seen this, it's a $3 item. So I got one of these. I got the regular Smudge Proof LA Colors um, Eyeliner. I've seen this before and gotten it before, so this is a repeat buy for me. And it's um, automatically when you turn it up, it sharpens as it goes up. This one is a new one I hadn't seen. This is by Tony. It's a uh, eyeliner pencil in black. It says it's waterproof. So we'll see. This is a, one I hadn't seen before, uh, and I'm going to try that. And So I got one of these. This is a notepad. I thought it was pretty colors, spring colors by Jot. It has the uh, two small little notepads at the bottom, and then it has the bigger one, lined one at the top. I do not think they're stick, though. Oh, no, it doesn't. Yeah, they're not, um, they're not like the post-it notes. I don't think they stick. Oh, no, they don't. And I thought they were separate. That's it. No, I thought they were separate, like separate pads at the bottom. It's one whole pad, um, but it does has have the perforated area. So if you write one note on this, you could uh, just tear it off. It has a perforated perforated area between these two, um, but it's one whole pad. Okay, I thought it was two. I thought they were separate. Okay. So I got one of those. That's by Jot. I needed some more of these for this, my Swiffer. Um, and this is uh, 10 inch by 8 inch. And it's 10 to a pack. And these are the wet ones. It's not the dry ones. It's the wet ones for your Swiffer. So I got two packs of these. Uh, $1.25 item. I've used them before. And they do just as good as the more expensive one. Um from Walmart or Target. Let's see what else, what else, what else. I did get some cleaning supplies. This works is uh, really good. I usually don't like it in this one. I like it in a spray bottle better, but they didn't have it. And this is the one for the classic toilet bowl cleaner. Cleans and de deodorizes. It's um, 24 fluid ounces. This is just as good. I just like it in the spray better. So I only got one of these. And then I got another, uh, this is a repeat buy when I see it. This is a $3 item. This is the, <clears throat> the Gain 24.3 uh, fluid ounces, the Gain dishwashing liquid. So I got that. Uh, does it have? There's no, just as original scent. Yeah. So I just got one of those. Repeat item, I get it when I see it usually. Then another cleaning. I got. I haven't tried this, so I'm not sure about this. 
This is disinf disinfectant fabric air freshener, original eucalyptus. And this helps for um, eliminate odors. And this is 32 fluid ounces. Of, this was a $3 item. So this is an Odo Van. Uh, so I don't know. So we'll see. And it's ready to use. You don't have to mix it with water or anything. Um, so we'll see. And they had some little jars that I saw. It. This is like an iridescent kind of color the way it looks. And it has the little uh, rose top. This is for, um, what does it say? You can use it uh, for food storage. Yeah, do not fill with hot liquids. Do not microwave, hand wash only. I guess maybe because of the iridescent look. But, um, yeah, but you can put uh, food storage in it. Like, I would put, like, blueberries, grapes, um, and things like that. Uh, strawberries go in the refrigerator. And if they're in glass jars, they last much longer. I have found that out. I got two of those, and that was a $1.25 item. all in that bag okay I've got some they usually have like the wallpaper the uh, peel and stick and I I saw this and I really I like the uh, design on it I'm not gonna do it use it for the wall but I'm gonna use it for a tray or something <laughs> that I make, but I thought that design was nice design. I liked it. It's the blue and gold, you can use it either way. So I only got, I get one or two. I got two of those. So I'm gonna use it for a decor DIY project. And then I saw this one that I thought was really pretty. I got two of those. And it's just the, um, it's just the peel and stick. And a wallpaper. So, I'm gonna use that, see how that comes out. And I thought this was cute. I, uh, if anybody what used to watch The Office, the Dunder Mifflin Paper Company, so they, I saw this, and they have, uh, this is peel and stick with, um, you got Dwight, and you got Stanley, I think it was Michael. Oh, God, I can't think of her name. Wow, Jim, Pam, and um, of course, Angela. <laughs> so I got those. I thought that was funny to put on something. So I only got one of those. Go back to the food items again. First time, and those wallpapers were $1.25 each. Um, so, who was it? Thrifty Tiffany, I think, with these. And this is the pretzels. This is by Pop Daddy Pretzels. This is a garlic and Parmesan pretzel stick. Um, and it's three ounces, but it tastes really good. I got three bags. I tried one. They are really good. Um, I wouldn't eat the whole bag at one sitting because it is really salty. But... They're really good. And um, she also said um, um, that they come in this, the garlic parmesan, and they come in a cinnamon. But the Dollar Tree I went to didn't have the uh, cinnamon twisted taste. So I didn't get to taste those, but I got three of these. And they had the um, Albanese Ultimate Flavor Gummies. Then the 2.5 ounce is for $1.25. I've seen these a lot in, uh, well, I've seen them in Walmart, which is the bag's a little bigger, and I've seen them in TJ Maxx. And of course, of course it's much uh, higher. Okay, 
I needed some more dill pickle. These are the kosher dill pickle spears. So I got uh, just one of these. Some of them have the flat ones like you put on sandwiches. I don't like those. Or they have the little round chips. I don't like those either, but I do like these. And I got, I was out of olives. I got olives. Usually I get the olives with the uh, the pits in them. But this one, they didn't have any with the pits. And I'm just assuming they're going to taste the same just without the pits. So I only got one jar. Um, both of these were a $1.25 item. So far as I know, the olives taste the same with or without the pits. So we'll see if they don't. I did find, which I should have got, I don't know, I should have got a couple of them, but I didn't. I only got one. And this is that flip out um, little carrier. They had it before. It was smaller than this, and they did not have a handle. Um, this time, this one has, uh, it's a little bigger, and it does have a handle. Um, let's see if I can open it and pop it open. So you're supposed to just be able to lift it up. And see how it pops out. Put the sides down. Let's see. So, it's just a little carrier. So, I thought that was really cute. You could use it for storage. You could use it to carry something around. Or you could put it in the uh, back of your car as well. And it just pops out. So, I got one of these. I had it in this... Um, they had it in this gray color, gray and black, and they had it in uh, blue, and they had it in white. Okay, so then I went down the craft or square aisle, and I saw this. This is in the craft or square aisle. This is cardstock. I only got one pack, and it's a pack of three, and it has these three colors in it, the pink, the blue, and the black, uh, and it's 12 by 12 decorative card stock. So, it has that little picture at the bottom, and that's, that's not embedded. That's just on the plastic. So, I got um, this. First time I've seen it uh, at the Dollar Tree, so I got it to try to see how, to see how it does. And then I saw these neat uh, rub-on transfers. And this just has the, um, it's like the little reefs at the top. And then it has the letters. And it's reefs at the bottom, but then it has like a deer and a fox and a rabbit. I think it's a rabbit. And an owl, yeah, on the inside. And the words down at the bottom say, uh, how does it say? Be kind. Yeah. So those are transfer, rub on transfers. So I got one pack of uh, this style. And then I got this pack. And this has, um, this has balloons on it, has flowers. Uh, dragonflies, uh, butterflies, looks like a little teepee, a teapot, shoes, arrows, um, so different things on it. And I got one of these. And then the other one I've got has, um, the word wish on it and it has a heart and just all different kind of little Butterflies, feathers, flowers, looks like a deer. So, I got one of each of those. <clears throat> then I saw for decoration, this is a garland. Has like the little tulips and all the little spring colors. So, I got this. I put up on my um, 
fireplace or either on my uh, table behind the couch. When you walk in the in my house, you have so you can see the table behind the couch. So I'll put it there. I saw this one first, so I got this one, and then this was a dollar twenty-five, and all the others um, craft stuff was a dollar twenty-five, and then I saw this. This was three dollars, and this is wood. And it has, <clears throat> what does it say? It says Happy Easter. So it's a garland, and it says Happy Easter. And it has like the butterfly, a bunny, not butterfly, the bunny ears in the middle. So you have the bunny ears, and it's got the bunny tail. So I thought this was neat. You see the pastel colors? And it's wood. I thought, man, wow. So I got this. This is what I'm actually going to put on my fireplace. But I thought this was really nice. So I got one of the uh, one of these. And this was $3. So that's going to be up for spring and for Easter. This is the last bag from the Dollar Tree. <clears throat> it may be just food items. I haven't seen this there in a while, but I really like these. These are really good. This is a little coconut crisp. And it's uh, 2.1 ounces. This is a good little snack. So I got two of these. I always like to get this when I see it. These are the uh, peanut clusters. I got three bags of these. And they're four uh, point, what's it? Four ounces. Yeah, so I got three of those. I like the double bubble bubble gum. I got two of those. I said food items. This is really a junk bag. Um. I got the fudge shortbread cookies, chocolate shortbread cookies. Only got one pack of those. I've gotten this before, and this is pretty good coffee. It's only four ounces. I got two of them. This is the vanilla cream brulee. And this is by Harry and David. So I got two of these, Harry and David coffee. And yet, it does taste pretty good. It's a food item, but for the kitties. This is the Sheba Cuts and Gravy Gourmet Salmon. And then I got them a turkey one. So I got two of these. For the little kitties. And I believe that is all from the Dollar Tree. Now let's go on to Target. Target had these little baskets, and it's the real, it's plastic, but it's like the really hard plastic. I mean, it's pliable, but it's like thick and sturdy. Um, and then it has the um, yarned handles. I saw this, this I, they had this color, they had white, and they had a green color. And I wish I had gotten two. I looked at them, and then I put this back, and then I came back to it. Because I thought, man, I don't need another bag. But this is really good. I really liked it. And I've already used it. And this was um, $3. And this for, uh, from Target. So I'm in my Target bag now. So I only got one. I saw these and I thought this was really pretty. I love that color. It's the pink and green design of little flowers. I thought that was so pretty and the little scallop edges. And it's just napkins. It was a dollar. Um, this is, doesn't say how many. Yeah, 12 napkins in it. Um, and it is the 10 by 10 size. So I thought for decoupage, I'd uh, want to decoupage this on something as a DIY project. But I thought they were so pretty. They only had one pack, so I just, I got... I got it. I wish they had more. I would have gotten that more. 
This also was on the, um, in that dollar, five dollar item area, because this was, um, five dollars. It's glass, but what I liked about it is that, i get it all. When I had it in this color, I think pink, maybe a blue. This is an odd color, so I got this, the green color. On the inside. But I really liked it and got it. Two reasons. One is glass, and then I like the rubber part on it as well. So if you put it down somewhere, if I happen to drop it, it will not break because of the rubber part, hopefully. Um, so I like that. So this is, I like it to, I can take um, things to work, you know, leftovers from work, fruit or, or anything like that. But I liked it. Sandwich, put a sandwich on one side, you know, something on the other side or just big enough for a sandwich. But um, so I only got one of them though. Uh, and this is, uh, like I said, the $5 item and it. Just locks down. So I got one of those. And then more decorations for Easter. I saw this. It's like an uh, shaped like an egg. And this was which is this? Three dollars. Yeah. So this is a three dollar item. So like an egg, and it see it's the LED light. So um, it's got a little light in it, um, so it will light up. So I thought that'd be cute. So that's what I'm gonna put up with my Easter decor. So I've got only got one of them. They had them in this color, and of course the blue, the pink, and white. One of those. And I thought this was really cute. I'm going to put this on my wood tear tray in my kitchen. <laughs> Decorate for Easter. And this. And then, well, you can keep it up, too, afterwards. This is $3 item. And it's just a little chicken with glasses. I like this part here, though. <laughs> the color, a little uh, blocking color there. So he's just a little neutral color, a little orange. And I thought he was cute with his little glasses. So I only got one. So he can actually go out now on the tear tray. Got a wreath for Easter. Ah, oh, this is cute. This was a five dollar item. So it's a wreath. Well, I thought it was really pretty. Different color little eggs and the little greenery and the flowers on it. Some little daisies. But I thought that was really nice. And uh, five dollars. So I'm gonna put that on my door for Easter. And these, I got this, let me see, these two little things. One say farm fresh carrots, and this one says carrot patch. Just little wood pieces. They were a dollar each. Uh, they were cute. They're going to go on the little, um, on the little tray as well. Very cute. Just little decorations for spring. And then I saw these baskets, which I, I really like these. They're really sturdy. And they were five dollars each. Yeah, so they were five dollars each, and I got two of them. And I thought these were really cute little baskets. So I got two of those. So, pull out the little chicken again. And I sell the, I thought these were nice. I don't know what I'm going to do, do with them, but they're the 
just little containers there and this was a five dollar item and it's just four glass containers with a little suction top I think it's plastic but it looks like wood so I don't know what I'm gonna put something I don't know I'm gonna use it either in my kitchen or in my craft room but I thought these were nice and they had um, they had the next size up they had a bigger size but they were not in the clear. They were in like a black glass color. And then the last thing I got for, from Target. Which I thought this was really cute. They had this in two different colors too. Uh, and it's just a little picture. It has the little uh, porn sprout here. And it is a measuring cup. And this was a $3 item. But I thought this was really cute. I like this one. So, that's what I got. And I think this is my last item from um, Target. Yes, it is. So, yep, that's it. So, um, thank you all for joining me. I hope you saw something that caught your eye, something that you really liked. Um, if you like me, then I think that's the only place I went in Target was just that dollar, um, and, um, spot and they have like, um, it's right in the front of the store, one of the entrances where you come in and it's like five different, um, um, sections of it. Um, they have all different, all different stuff. Um, and some, I mean, I thought this was pretty good stuff between anything from a dollar to five dollars. So that's what I always hit when I go to Target and then I go over and go to the Starbucks area. So, <clears throat> and, um, of course the Dollar Tree, I always go there and find something. Sometimes I don't, but uh, there's always repeat items that I, I need. So anyway. Hopefully you saw something that you um, really needed or really liked or just wanted to go and find for yourself between Dollar Tree and Target. So again, if you are not subscribed, please subscribe. Please hit the notification button so you know when uh, the next time I upload. Thank you all for coming again. Last time I looked, I had like 90 something subscribers. So again, when I get to 100 subscribers, um, I will... Um, let you know and there will be a uh, contest uh, just to answer two questions that's personal about me that I've sprinkled throughout the um, uh, different videos that I've had. So if you've been watching for a while, you've heard me um, give the answers to those two questions. So hopefully soon we'll have 100 subscribers. That'll be great, great, great. I'm thankful for the 90 plus that I do have. Um, I really appreciate it. Really appreciate you all coming back. So please leave me a thumbs up. It helps the channel. Leave me a comment. I always reply. And um, again, if you're not already a subscriber, please hit that subscribe button and uh, the notification bell. If you are a subscriber, thank you, thank you, thank you for returning and coming back. I really appreciate it. So this has been a long video. So let me just um, get out of here. So, um, but I do want to say today has been a very, very nice day here in North Carolina. It, uh, it was, um, cooled earlier this morning, but then the rest of the day turned out to be really nice and sunny. I think it got up to maybe 60. Um, so maybe spring is closer than we think. And I, um, heard the birds this morning. And I was like, oh, maybe spring is closer than I think. So really glad about that. Spring is my favorite time, even though it's a short um, season. It is my favorite season. So, like I always say, please be kind to one another. Please be respectful to one another because we all have to live in this world together. So, why not be kind and respectful? So, thank you again, guys. Until next time. Bye.